So with the Might Aura, he, he could do 4,800 damage, plus the Deadly Strike and the... Uh, and he just died. Alright, well, um... <laughs> I need some better survivability, but there you have it. That's the weapon I made. And, uh, let me know if you have any questions or comments below. <laughs> I just wanted to make this video to show that my Merc can finally survive the pits and help. Player difficulty, let's do 7. So I have the, the Death Rune Word I made and the Eth Colossus Sword. I have an Eth Ariot's Face uh, for the Life Stolen Per Hit, some resistances. Shaft Stop, uh, low on the damage reduction but still needed. Uh, do, 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 laying of hands for 20%, attack speed, some more life stolen per hit, and then uh, goblin toe for crushing blow. So, who can he fight first? Alright, we can fight that. Let's go play with it. I've been using this uh, Nodge's Puzzler for uh, the three charges of Blink, which definitely helps. So he does uh, 26... 100 to 5,000 damage, 3,000 defense, or a max resist. Alright, let's go to uh, see what the fun is. Alright, let me try to roll through the key. See if we surprise that. And I don't even have that. Wait. Alright, let's try River of Flame. Right. Let's move this around. Huh? I like to use Cloak of Shadows to blind everything. Pretty good, pretty good. Oh no. Oh, of course. He just recovered.
Alright, so that's about it. You can actually survive. So I'm happy, and uh, I'll probably need a lot of other upgrades, but at least he uh, survives without dying instantly. That's it. Thanks for watching.